I want my MTV. Hi, this is Ron with Wheel in the Sky. Today, I've got another great MTV interview for you. It's an interview with all three members of the band, Steve Perry, Neil Sean, and Jonathan Kane. The only one you're going to see in this interview, though, is Steve Perry. The other two are off screen. Steve Perry is talking about the Raised on Radio documentary and what you're going to see in it, what it's all about, and things like that. It seems the Frontiers and Beyond documentary was a great success. It was on home video and played on MTV, and now they're trying to replicate that by making a new documentary about the new album, Raised on Radio. This one was not released on home video. It only played on MTV, so it's a little bit harder to find, but I'm sure you can find it here on YouTube. So here's Mark Goodman with the interview, and take it away, MTV. The band has gone through since their last album, and they plan to open up about a lot of it in an upcoming documentary. There was an awful lot that went on in our lives. Um, like John was just saying, that I think the documentary, when it's all edited together, um, will will explain what can happen to, to a rock band and to, to people's personal lives, which influences their professional lives. And, and uh, you know, we're not, uh, we're not oblivious to life's um, hatchets, you know. They come to us, too. And uh, without getting specific, there were some very, very low times in each of our lives, uh, in our personal lives. And um, I think the documentary is going to probably clarify uh, for those of you who um, would like to know uh, just, just what happened to us. I was still not sure whether the documentary will be released on home video, on cable, or another form. But one thing is certain, it will feature plenty of concert footage. And thank you, Mark. In fact, he's right. The Raised on Radio documentary has plenty of concert footage. In fact, it's the only place you're going to see the 1986 tour. There really isn't any other videos of the tour. I'm sure if they went to Japan like they were supposed to, there, there might have been some concert footage that we'd be able to see and share. But we do have some bootleg live performances. So we get Jailhouse Rock and things like that. And I'm working on my next video, and I hope to have it ready soon. I just saw the concert at the Crypto.com Arena here in Los Angeles, California. It was a great concert, and I'll tell you all about it in that video. I'm doing a whole wrap-up and talking about the concert and showing some footage, so stay put for that. And thank you very much.